think it'd be cool if like foxes did that against Jigglypuff instead of going for up smash and neutral. Because when she's at like 100, right? It's yeah. just way better. Absolutely. Yeah. Her peak's up tilt is also like really crazy and weird and like positive on shield when you hit the second hit of it. It's my least favorite move ever. I hate it. I hate all of Captain Falcon moves worse, but after those, I hate she cut the most, I think. It's stupid. Yeah. All right, well, we're playing. It doesn't reach on the stage. He's got to know that. <laughs> he just threw it twice and it did nothing. I think Wally in the corner pretty well. Yeah, yeah. Um, Wally used to... I think he used to like this matchup because, like, before, like, when he was coming up, he played Clyde a lot. Yeah. They were, like, partners. But, um, I think his, his more recent opinion is that this matchup is really, really hard for Peach and it's, like, their second worst after Buff. It is. It does look pretty bad, like, sometimes when the right person is at the reins. That's, a, that's the first stock for Tommy. Yeah. That was bad DI, but a really good Nair. Oh, no, uh, I think the only way to recover is. Oh, wow. Never mind. I was gonna say he should have switched to Zelda at least for like a little bit. That'd be funny. But the high up B actually worked out. And there again, that recovery is good because like the usually like the travel time from your up B when you're fully above ledge like that is like way more than they expect. And so they usually like don't cover ledge. Right. Yeah, Tommy is doing it at like some good spots. I agree. Tommy's like the only sheet that I see do that like directly. I, I see. Ledge. I see Just Jason do it a lot. But mm. I, I call it the Just Jason recovery in my head because I, <laughs> I saw him do it like a bunch of times once. The early double jump killed him there because he didn't have many trajectories. And Sheik's up B has, actually takes a while to become like uh, invincible. It's kind of like when she's fully horizontal, right? I'm not sure. In the animation, I just kind of know like the timing a little bit. Ah, uh, gotcha. But sometimes I'll sometimes I'll jump out there with you. Like... Yeah, Tommy's uh, aerial pressure is really good, in my opinion. But also, my... kind of unfortunate. Yeah, he gets the cross up there. By the time he does come ledge, I think it actually might have been free. Yeah. Just because, like, for Peach there, grabbing ledge, if that timing is a huge commitment, so, like, I don't think many Peach is go for it. Right. And he's at high percent, right? If you're at low percent, don't do that. If you're at high percent, you can gamble on the ledge. It's a big grab. Is that an up air? Is that gonna kill? Not yet. I'm surprised I didn't kill. Yeah, I don't, we never know if Sheik's up air. It's a weird move. He hit the strong hit, but maybe not. I'm not. I don't know, cause I think he got the. I think he got like the early hit. There's one with that boxes. You can't like go without. You can't miss those kills in this matchup. Sheik's whole point. The whole point of Sheik is that she's a fishing killer. Yeah. Right, she hits the edge guard. She has the grab. Uh, right. Have you? Yeah, she is. Oh, he went for it all. You know what? That's fine, because it's best of five set. You shake it off and you go back set. into it. And you know what? They can't play on the big stage anymore, so those up airs are going to kill in all of them. Wally and I just locked eyes, and I don't know what to make of it. He, like, looked back and looked me in the eyes. I don't think it means anything. <laughs> I did that or it's Shut the fuck up. But I didn't say any anti-Wally propaganda. Okay, Yoshis. I think the two big counterpicks are Battle Build and Yoshis. And they're not really that different. Because the whole point is that she gets to move really fast on them. Because yeah. Tommy's special and bloody. Yeah. Um, but this stage also has Randall, which is actually really good for Sheik. <laughs> and the, the, the earlier kills, I guess. But that bubble went up and up. Whoa! That was a really nice thing. It's amazing to me how Tommy gets in its head, but like is able to shake it off and go up. Yeah. Because I saw him shake his head. Usually I think, oh, that's probably going to be in the set, but anyways. Yeah. It's a really important skill. I was definitely composed in our set until game three, and then I was just sad. Yeah. It felt bad, but it was like, that's competition. And I mean, that stupid stuff, okay. guy. <laughs> but, uh, this is looking really good for Tommy in this game. That grab, I was not expecting. Boost grab. I don't agree with, like, a lot of swag attempts on Peach, because she just gets out of combos way too easily. Yeah, you need to, you need to be, like, really discreet and, and like, do your thing and then, like, go back to neutral. Absolutely. This and Puff are like the two matchups where like my philosophy are I need to know all of my true combos. In stocks, but this is like this is a tough lead in this matchup, I think. Yeah. You have to actually get okay, combo broken like several times. Right. Um whoa, Tommy's doing a really good job at just like 
taking its time in neutral, building up the percent. I don't agree with that. I would have despaired. I think it was fine. <laughs> but the fair is also good. She is like really good at the platform check chase. So it's like, I don't know, she just covers the whole platform so well. But actually on, on Yoshi's, you can't do the delayed fair because you're just time the platform, right? So the up smash might have just been smarter. That's fair. You have to do like immediate fair. I don't remember the situation. But she was really far to the right. Right. Air dodge. I don't think Wally has anything. Yeah. Air dodge. It doesn't matter if he lands, but he still likes. Jeez, can you believe he just forward air? It's that stupid. <laughs> he was right there. That's a chain. Yeah, if he had been like, I guess like crept with like a wall jump, locked in wood, that could have gone better. Yeah. And now we can see Battlefield. Um, I like this. I think he didn't change up his counter picks last week. Not sure. I don't remember, but I like him switching it up, trying all three stages. Yeah. You'll never oh, catch me doing scary. any of that. <laughs> Take me to FD five times. But I think maybe this might work better because I know Wally really likes Yoshi's. Um, I think he uses his aerial placement really well on that stage, and he yeah. applied a lot of pressure, pressure. So this would give uh, Tommy a lot more room to move. Yeah, I also think, like, um, Peach might have a little bit harder time edge guarding, just because the platform is really high up. Right. And everything is spaced out so far. Yeah. And then, like, when you hit Sheik across the stage, you have to run all the way over there. Like, he gets ledge for free. He doesn't <laughs> get ledge for free on Yoshi's there. Right. I hate Sheik's roll from ledge. It's so good. Really? Yeah. I don't think I have, like, uh, the character's different, like, roll from ledge lengths on file. I have other rolls. I have regular like, rolls. It's not the length that bothers me. It's uh, the invulnerability on it. Oh, I see. It's invincible forever. That's annoying if you're Marth and you can't just, like, jump over there. Right. Yeah, I can't, like, just soft nair. Go straight down. Well, he's ready for it. He's not close enough to actually pick on the ledge. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, wow. Uh, it should be G Dog and you, right? Or it's winner between like G Dog and Kuma and Hemp, but I don't know who won between Kuma and Hemp. Uh. I do think uh, that the G-Dog is like the greatest player of our generation, and so he'll probably defeat all comers. Yeah, G-Dog's actually insane. From online tournaments alone, I know G-Dog kind of owns him, though they haven't nice. played yet. That's Michael. right, because South Jersey used to have this. Yeah, we used before, to have... Before Slippy. Before Slippums. Yeah. Big grab. I'm really happy that he shield grabbed instead of wave dashing out of shield and up tilting. Yeah. Tommy's insane. Michael, um, did G-Dog and Hemp play yet? That's a bad Sad. SD. And Tommy homie stocks. He was at like 100%, so it didn't even really matter. That, <laughs> but he whenever, did homie stock. Whenever I see that, that's always... I, I, I'm like, disrespecting me. Oh, yeah. I mean, oh, that's actually literally a specific thing Wally said on commentary Tommy should do next time he gets an up air string like that, is weak up air at the end and then forward air. And he did it. It means he watched his VODs and he listened yeah. to Wally. That or he's just really smart and knows to do that anyway. Tommy's a grinder. Yeah. He was all over that platform. I didn't know where he was going. Yeah, that was that made peace here. JJM tag. I like it. JJM has the coolest What's netplay up? name ever. Yeah. No, but they also have not played like after COVID, like in these tournaments. And Tommy has been beating Bats, so it's a good set.
Well, that was a smart up tilt. That's the, the shield fire. Yeah. I don't really like this stage as a counter pick against Sheep. I think everything works too well for her. Maybe. Well, my, sure. my biggest thing is, like, up tilt's really good on these platforms, and she also, like... Yeah, that is true. The changing platform heights, all, uh, heights also really mess up when you can get under her if she's doing, like, the needles around the flats. Um, and that tall, uh, um, top flat, although it's not as tall as that, okay. but anyways. It's actually pretty close to the Yoshi's top flat height. Yeah. But, um, I think, like, the spacing between the platforms, like, laterally kind of messes up with her movement a little bit. Um, like, that's just, like, an awkward, like, sense to go sometimes. Right. I don't know. There's never, like, certainty with that movie, it's the thing, right? Like, you don't actually know what you're getting, which isn't necessarily, like, like a bad thing. No, it's always a bad thing. But, like, it, you don't actually know, like, I don't know, like, sometimes it could be like this, sometimes there could be no platforms. I don't know. Yeah, I am a bot hater. The thing is, is we, we are, uh... I think Peach also likes, though, that, like, she can't really... Like, the platforms don't go over the ledge. They're not really that close to the ledge. Right. So, like, that disrupts Sheik's upbeat. And that also means that you can, like, be under a platform without being cornered, necessarily. Right. Like, that's something really good about Stadium that I like. Um, that's Young Link, because I can use the side platforms without cornering myself. Yeah, the uh, the platforms make it really difficult to come off the ledge with Marth. So like, because every character I feel like can do like like the spaces can do wave land back airs off that platform to cover like pretty much all my options. Sheik does wave land off fair or fair. Like it's they're really good platforms for yeah. like everybody. But Marth Whoa, that was really good. Yeah, this could be a huge momentum shift. Oh, I've seen Wally do that fair like slightly faster than that, so that might have been an error from him. Yeah. I feel like when he hits me with that combo, like the back air on the ledge and then the go off fair, he's like moving at the speed of play. Yeah. I think whoever wins this stock wins the game. Yeah. Whoa, really good ledge snag. That was, that was amazing. He gets the Wally eye I, I roll. <laughs> I didn't. I was too mesmerized by, by uh, Tommy's ramen noodles. Oh yeah, that was a beautiful ledge grab. Alright, zero percent, but he does have spawn info, so oh, he really is good. Gets so good. Oh, I think the grab there would have been beautiful. That's also why the stage is good for Peach. Yeah. But like the thing is, is that Tommy's shown already that he's not gonna fall for the down smash spam. I guess, but like the. On the platform, like, the scramble will actually take you both onto the platform, right? And you can't, like, punish because it'll push you off. Right. So, like, that was still just, like, good for Wally. Like, he hit the shield, and it was fine. Oh, that's a rare error. He didn't want to do the down smash because everyone in this entire building has been on the crazy Nijik and DI, but invalidates the down smash edge guard. So he went for the cross-up there, and it didn't work. Okay, wow. Tommy kind of dropped a juggle situation there. And that yeah. Was